In this video, you will learn how to back up system files in Windows 7. You must know that Windows doesn't make a backup of the program files installed, the deleted files in the recycling bin, or the files which are formatted using the FAT file system. All the temporary files which are under 1 GB also don't get saved during the backup process. Okay now, let's get started. First of all, you will need to open up the backup and restore window. You can do that via the control panel, or simply going to My Computer, right-clicking on the partition you want to create a backup of, and click on Properties. With the new window opened up, move to the Tools tab and click on the Backup Now button. This will open up the Backup and Restore window. If you're creating a backup for the very first time, this window over here will open up. Simply click on the Setup Backup option to get started with the process. In this window, you will be required to select where the backup is going to be saved. With that done, you can move on to the next step. If you want to save the backup in a network location, simply click on the Save on a Network button over here. You will be required to define the path of the network, where the backup is going to be saved, along with the username and password, which will be needed for accessing the location to save the backup on the network. In the next step, you will be shown two options. The first option lets Windows automatically choose which files are to be included in the backup. This will not include the temp files, the deleted files in the recycling bin, or the files which are formatted with FAT. Alternatively, you can choose the second option, which allows you to manually select which files are to be included in the backup. Now simply tick on the files and folders which you want to include in the backup. The option below allows you to include a system image in the backup. Over here, let's create a backup of the user's libraries. With that done, simply click on Next to move on to the next step. Over here, you will get to review the settings for the backup. Below you will notice the Schedule section. Right now it is set to every Sunday at 7 p.m. To change that, simply click on the Change Schedule option. Over here you can set how often the backup is to be taken, the day and the time when it is to be taken. You can disable the Schedule option by ticking on the checkbox above as well. Now let's click on the Save Settings and Run Backup button. With that done, Windows will start backing up the selected data. Over here you can click on the View Details button to check out how much percentage of the data is backed up. You can also stop the backup from here also. Once the backup is made, if you would like to make changes in the backup settings, for example, changing the files and folders to be backed up, then click on the Change Settings button, and you would be able to make the changes accordingly.